Hello. Okay. Kombucha on deck. I have recently become a kombucha, kombucha, whatever, fiend. I love it. I used to hate it. I drank one once and it literally was the worst thing I've ever tasted. Then recently I tried a different brand and now I need kombucha every single day. And apparently it's good for your gut and I've always had digestive issues. Anyways, I hope you're doing well. During final season, I'm struggling right now. I have so much to do. Just like ugh, so many things that I need to take care of. That said, I have been finding so much pleasure in preparing for my trip. I'm going to Europe for a couple weeks with my friends and with my family. So I have been shopping, thrifting mostly, trying to find fun new festive pieces for the summer. And it's also festival season. So got to get on that. I'm going to show you all the pieces that I've gotten lately from curated thrift stores, normal thrift stores, and ThreadUp. This video is sponsored by ThreadUp. So thank you to ThreadUp for working with me on this one. I love ThreadUp. They're an online consignment and thrift store. Their filtering system is so easy to use, so you can really cater your shopping experience to what you like, brands that you like, or certain styles that you like. And they have a new thrift the look feature where you get to shop looks that some of your like favorite influencers have worn before. And obviously it's sustainable, which we love. Cheers to that. I got so many cute things that are perfect for summer and for festival fits. You see a lot of festival fits, kind of one hit wonders type outfits instead of buying these outfits that you only wear once. I feel like it's more fun to thrift them. It's less wasteful. I picked out some items that I would wear to a festival. I'm definitely not the person that pulls up at the festival with like the funkiest, coolest outfit. I'm more of a comfort over anything person, but I did find some funkier things. And I was also shopping with Europe in mind. I feel like whenever I travel, I just become more fashionable because I don't know anyone wherever I am and I just feel more comfortable wearing whatever I want. So I'm gonna start by just showing you guys the outfit that I styled with Red Up. It's kind of like my festival inspired fit. The first thing I picked out is this tube top. It's by LF the brand. It's estimated retail is $42.99 and I got it for $30.10. And $30.10. I actually don't know how to say that properly. So 29% off. I thought it looked really cool. Formula One vibes. I like the color. I don't know. I like graphic tees, graphic tops. I styled it with this varsity jacket I'm wearing. It's Bella's. I actually want to keep this forever. It's the best. I need to find a varsity jacket actually. Next time I'm on thread up, I'm gonna be looking for that. And then I styled it with these shorts that are from Paxson that I got on thread up that are so nice, cheeky, cute, very festival esque. Festival esque. Um, let's just pretend that's a word. The estimated retail is only $9.99 and I got these for $6, so 39% off, which is really good. Super flattering and I love the bottom, like the, the this the frills, the frills, the fringe, I don't know. And then I just styled all this with Adidas. I don't know how to say that in English. Adidas, low forums, and this bag. I find burgundy and navy blue look so good together. The bag is by the brand Chateau. It's estimated retail is $17.99 and I got it for $14.50, so 19% off. It looks like bougie, but it's not. I love the color. Wow. So yeah, it's like my festival fit, festive fun. Love it. To get 30% off your first order with ThreadUp, you can just click the link in my description and use the code AVA. You get 30% off your first order and free shipping. So yeah, I'm going to show you guys the rest of the pieces I got from ThreadUp. We've got this top. I'm very much on the tube top in the tube top game for festivals for summer. This one is from Urban. Estimated retail $9.99 and I got it for seven bucks. So 29% off. Super cute, flattering, fits tight. I I love tube tops. I'll just wear a tube top and then wear a cute coat when it's like kind of warm out, perfect for the spring. And I also got this one from Out From Under, estimated retail $8.99. And I got it for $6.30, which is 30% off. I like the trim. Perfect staples to wear with more funky bottoms. Cool skirts with more complex patterns. Good basics to have in your closet. And they're super affordable on ThreadUp. And then the tube top I'm wearing right now is by Express. It was $4.99 and I got it for $3.95. 20% off. And that's what I like about ThreadUp too is these are brands that I would never shop from normally just because they're fast fashion, terrible for the environment. And so shopping on ThreadUp allows me to shop guilt-free, which is really awesome because sometimes, you know, you want stuff from Urban. Is it normal that there's so much shit at the bottom? I like literally mix it all the time. I don't think I... 
It's not my favorite brand. Oh, Jesus. And then I got this out from under sheer top. It has like the stars on it. This is one of those pieces that depending how you style it, it could either be not at all the vibe or very fun. And I feel like in order to make this a good top in an outfit, I would have to wear low rise cargo pants. I wouldn't wear denim shorts with this. That would be bad. I don't think that that would look good. I would need like a really cool pair of pants to make this cooler, look cooler. Does that make sense? Sometimes you have those pieces that just on their own, they don't do it, but with the right piece it just becomes cool that's kind of how i envisioned this top but yeah i don't know how i feel about it to be honest and then we've got these pants i don't know how you call these it's like this material, like a rain jacket material by the brand EMS. Estimated retail $17.99 and I got them for nine bucks. So 49% off. These are cool when they fit oversized. I feel like the baggy look just looks really good and is super in style. These do fit a bit small on me, so I'm probably gonna give them to one of my like smaller friends. I'm gonna try to find another pair on thread up because they have so many that's more baggy because I feel like it's such a cool look with like a small top, even a tube top and some cool sneakers, Jordans or something. I actually really want Jordans. Anyways, last but not least, this is my favorite piece I got. It's this coat from Urban Outfitters. It's so perfect. I really don't have a lot of spring coats. I just like always wear my North Face throughout the winter and the spring and fall. So I need some more in between coats when it's chilly but not freezing out. It's so elegant and pretty. It makes me feel really bougie. Like I could be wearing sweatpants and I put that on and suddenly I'm put together. It's so pretty. Okay, now I'm gonna show you quickly what I got from this like curated thrift store in Montreal. I only got two pieces. I was literally in that store for an hour and a half and I couldn't find anything. I was really feeling picky that day. It's a type of store where you find things and then you look at the price you're like, that's not worth it. I could find this in a thrift store for cheaper. So I just ended up getting two things, but this really caught my eye. I like casual wear, if you hadn't noticed. So I got this Harley Davidson tee. I just thought it looked cool. I like the color. I know I'm gonna wear it so much and I got it for $24. And then I got this dress. I don't know, I, I really could see myself wearing it as a swimsuit cover up this summer. So I was like, why not? It's by L'Avion Rose. It's this little slip and I love the back. It's like that. I don't know. I wear lingerie to the beach all the time as swimsuit cover-ups and it was $35, which is, yeah, way too much. But it caught my eye. At that point, I had been in there for so long that I was like, I can't leave empty-handed. Let's just get this. Like, it's cute, whatever. The rest is stuff I just got from generic thrift store. This I love so much. This was five bucks. Brown, long, flowy skirt. Very bohemian vibes. Reminds me of the Brandy Melville skirts they sell that I love. It's a meaty skirt, so it's pretty long, flowy. I just love, love skirts that when I'm wearing them and I walk around and stuff, it like flows around me. It's so awesome. And brown is so versatile and beautiful. I think styling this with a paler brown top, beige even, looks really good. And the bottom has little things, lace with little sprinkles, not sprinkles, Um, what am I saying? With little beads, love that. Then I got this red slip dress. It's so beautiful. Wear this on a night out at a nice restaurant, accessorize with some pretty gold jewelry. Even the purse from Threada would look so good with this. This was $8.50, classic. You can't go wrong with a red silk dress. You just can't. Next, I got this top for $4.50. This is, once again, swimsuit cover-up. Perfect for going to the beach. I feel like I could also wear this with a bralette under it because it is a bit see-through and then style it with some baggy low-rise jeans and that would be like a casual little um, touring day or something. It could also be worn over a tee. I feel like that's cute, like over a baby tee. So many ways to style this, but I was really drawn to the colors. I find that the lilac is stunning. One of my favorite colors. Next, I got another slip dress. This was $15.50 and it's by La Vian Rose as well. I think that they have like the best lingerie. I'm not sure what green this is. Slip silk dress. So beautiful and if it's really tight, which I always struggle with when I buy lingerie, it's always too big because I have no boobs. So I'm so happy that this one fits tight because it makes it look less like lingerie when it actually fits. <laughs> I feel like if I wore a coat over it, it could pass off as just like a normal dress. Same vibe as the red dress. And I got this. Whenever I go thrifting, I always see these in the lingerie section these under like skirts that go under whatever I don't even know apparently you're supposed to wear these under other things like under dresses I didn't know that I was drawn to this one I love the lace detail at the front it was $6.99 I feel like with a white top do an all white fit with some sneakers obviously classic Reeboks so it's like casual but also elegant fancy I don't know there's so many ways to style this also I've seen people wear these types of skirts with baggy shirts like long what are they called oversized t-shirts that's something I would wear. Grandmother energy, which I channel all the time. I love it. Next, I got this tube top. I actually debated getting it in the thrift store because I was like, Ooh. 
what is this i liked the color the pattern was really cool 550 i'm probably gonna cut this it's really long i think it looks really cool it can also be a skirt very versatile in that way i could cut it through the middle make one skirt one top and then make like a two-piece set oh this is my favorite top i think i thrifted bella hadid has worn this before 4.99 and it's this little t-shirt beige it's really tight you don't need a bra i just really like the v-neck but it's like a high v-neck which is really flattering and the short sleeves almost like a tank top which i really like it's just like stretchy Ugh, it's the best material it's my favorite i still have this dress very pajama vibe 650 i feel like depending on what i wear it with i don't know it could be worn out this is the type of thing that i would wear kind of on a day lounging somewhere meaning that i wouldn't wear this like walking around a city but if i was just hanging out with my friends and doing a couple grocery errands and then <laughs> cooking at home i would wear this i love the colors it's really cute it's by licenza classic little lingerie piece next i got this whenever i thrift it's like i can't not buy some blouse i know why i'm so drawn to them i just really like the style of the blouse over a bralette only one button buttoned up so you see the bralette sexy chic elegant this one was 550 and i just love the color and the blue patterns on it it's a bit sheer which is so beautiful green has always been something that i really like it with my blue eyes I don't know it's just a color that when i see it i have to get it this with a mini black skirt chef's kiss for like a dinner and then in the same vibe i got another dress shirt kind of for 6.99 i just like the paisley but i don't know i'm definitely not obsessed with this but the paisley and the colors i thought were really pretty white bralette one button buttoned up mini white skirt with sneakers that's so cute lunch date or something with gold jewelry obviously i mean i only wear gold jewelry so obviously i'm gonna say that but i think gold jewelry looks so good with everything it's also very summery next i got this super simple this is another thing i tend to get like long sleeves in the winter time you will not catch me wearing a cute fit ever i'm in sweatpants 24 7 it's because i'm cold i get cold so easily that i don't really want to dress up nice because i know i'm gonna freeze so yeah i just always like to get long sleeves i loved the color of this and the design it's very in style it's not everyone's favorite my sister hates it but i think it's really cute and this was 6.99 this is what i live in in winter just like this type of top it's definitely casual you could dress it up with a black mini skirt and black boots i'm gonna wear that next i got this dress actually bella found this for me when we were thrifting together and it's awesome it really reminds me of oh mighty actually they have stuff that looks like this it's this licenza long dress sheer it's see-through and it has a cut on the side what's this called again um a slit it has a slit down the side which i'm obsessed with i'm excited to wear this when i'm tan because this washes me out right now wear this on the beach or even on a warm day somewhere i would definitely wear this in the street with some booty shorts another kind of spring coat my sister said this looks like something my dad would buy this was 20 bucks i don't care what my sister says this is the type of coat i love to wear in the spring once again i like the dad aesthetic a lot more than like a girly coat i just feel more comfortable in something big and casual i think it's because it goes more under noticed and i get so insecure dressing in the city because everyone looks at you up and down and like i can't deal with that montreal is a very i feel like people are very judgmental here i know it's also me being in my head but yeah i like simpler <laughs> garments but like i said once i'm out of the city this summer i'm gonna be dressing funkier and i'm really excited for that if you are interested in shopping my look shopping other festival inspired bits or just thrifting in general you can click the link in my description and use code ava for 30 percent off your first order and free shipping I I hope you guys enjoyed this stay tuned for the summer there are going to be a lot of italy chronicles type videos coming out end of june july Mwah. love you what's for sale i might buy it all don't want to put in work now you just want to buy got louis bags with no money in them